Because if you let the sun go down, you give the enemy place. He yeah. said, nor give place to the devil. Mm -hmm. So I told you, that's the emotion that God has given us where it's okay for us to be angry, Man, but he tell us not to sin. Mm -hmm. Now, if you get angry about that situation uh -huh. because this just happened, it's okay for be angry at that time, oh, yeah. but then you got to let that go. Right. You can't hold that anger for 10 and 15 and 20 years because uh -huh. I told you right. it's a root to things. And we know that Jonah was dealing with unforgiveness. Mm -hmm. He did not like, he did not want to go to Nineveh when right. God first came to him. Jonah being the prophet of God, called by God, mm -hmm. and God told him to go, but he ran and went another way because he just did not want to go to these people mm -hmm. because of his unforgiveness, because of racism, uh -huh. and all of that. It's always something that's going to attach itself Amen. to whatever it is. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yeah. If it's anger, well, Amen. then it's going to be some unforgiveness. Amen. It's going to be some type of hate, some yeah. type of rage. Mm -hmm. It's going to be some type of thing that going on in the inside come on, come on. where you raging on the inside oh yes so Jonah did not want to go to Nineveh he, he did not want to go but he was angry because remember God gave him the message he said go and preach to Nineveh these eight words he said yet 40 days and Nineveh shall be overthrown uh -huh. that was the message that God gave him Jonah was trying to comfort these people Jonah was not trying to push these people to uh -huh. God and go ahead and ask God to forgive you uh -huh. and Jonah went and preached those eight words uh -huh. and he left out because he wanted God to really Amen. destroy Nineveh. Oh, yes. He wanted him to destroy oh, those yes. people. Yes. Be the man of God. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Come on, ladies. Yeah, talking. Men and women of God. Yeah, yeah, come on. They have been to that point mm -hmm. yes, 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 where yes, God, yes. I'm just going to say what yes, you tell me to say, yes. and I'm not going to encourage. Oh, I'm not going to comfort. I'm not going to yes. pat on the back. Come I'm on, not going to push. Yes. I'm not going to do. I know y'all oh, ain't yes. going to be honest. Come on, I've been there. I've been there. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. But Jonah went and preached those eight words and mm -hmm. left it at that. <laughs> And when he preached those eight words, oh my. he angry. <laughs> the Lord said, is it right? Is it well for you to be angry? John? Oh my God. Do you have the right to be angry? Is it good for you to be angry? No, it's not good for us to be angry because guess what? It causes problems in our bodies. It physically attacks our bodies. You wonder, a headache comes, your chest pain comes, you start having problems in the body. Jonah stopped by. Mm -hmm. Jonah was so angry. Yeah, so. Some people are so angry. So, angry. so much unforgiveness. So uh, much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They so enrage. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. They are kindling with anger oh, in the oh, inside, yeah. and you don't even know it's boiling. Oh, my. Oh, my. Look, yeah, not just against people, but oh. against God. Oh, well, yeah. that's it. Come on. Because Jonah felt like he had the right to be angry, and he did at that time. At that time. Because guess what? They, the Nineveh was some wicked people. Yeah. They began to kill the children of Israel. They began to attack them and hang them up and, mm -hmm. and, and let the animals eat on them and so forth. So they made a mockery of them. Uh -huh. Jonah said, judgment needs to come. Needs Have somebody <laughs> ever done something uh, to you so wrong? Oh, 
He was waiting on God to destroy it. That's how much anger and unforgiveness and, and racism that he had in his heart where he went out to set. Mm -hmm. What have you set in your heart where you just waiting on something Temples, to happen? You set it to the side. God, they hurt me, so I need you to hurt them. Oh, my God. We don't say it in those words, but in our heart, it's full of it. God, they cheated on me. God, I'm waiting on you to deal with them. I'm sitting to the side, and I'm just waiting, God. They lied on me, God. So when you going to get them? That's it. They put their hands on me, God. When you going to deal with them? They stole from me. See, this is stuff That's that people it. don't want to yeah. talk about. Because you know what? They done been swept under the rug That's for so right. long. And so all we're yeah. doing is walking over the rug. Uh -huh. We're walking over the rug and everything else is still yeah. there. Uh -huh. But when you want true deliverance, you know what? I'm raising the rug up. Yeah. Because I got some unforgiveness there. Yeah. They lied on me. They cheated on me. They Jonah was angry. Yes. And you got a lot of people. Yes. People yes. of God. Yes. That's, us. that's angry. That's mm -hmm. us. And, and, and have yes. unforgiveness. Right. And now we have became spiritual buzzers. So uh, we're sitting at the side waiting on something to die. No. Uh, waiting on uh, something to happen to our enemies. Yeah, oh, yes. For what they done to us. Yes. Who they took from us. We in Jonah the fourth chapter the fifth verse. I told you you didn't create nothing nor no one. Come on. Do you really have a right to be or to stay angry? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You you can get angry at that time, but you gotta let it go. You 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 you, you didn't create anything. That's it. So we get mad at something and, and oh they took this and they did that. We didn't create nothing. Yeah. Yeah. That's me. So people hold that in their heart and the enemy try to make sure that they hold that. Yeah. That they blame God and they blame the yeah. people of God. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah. 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 Jonah was sitting. Oh, yeah. Look, he's sitting there on the side. Mm -hmm. You want God to judge them. Yeah, but you sitting to the side with so much unforgiveness in your heart. So much anger in your heart. Guess who God looking at? Look, he looking at you. You want him to look at them and judge them, but he looking at you. He got to show you you while you sitting to the side and you, you waiting on something. I know that it's suppressed and I know that it's covered up Get angry. He said, Be angry, but see it not. Do not let the sun go down on your wrath. Don't let the sun go down on your anger. You got to let it go. What Frozen said, Let it go. Let it go. You got to let it go completely. And sometimes it may be hard, but you got to say, Why would I hold on to this? Come on. Oh, yeah, yeah. Towards these people, I didn't create them. God created them. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. God, God got control over this. Why, why am I trying to hold why? on to something? Why? Hold on to unforgiveness. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So he saw to the side. Some people are sitting to the side. And I know we, we come to church. I know we praising God. Some people don't even want to praise God no more. You know why? They can't. Oh, Jesus. Because it's what's in the heart. Uh -huh. The enemy don't want you to raise Come your on, hands. The yeah. enemy don't want you to clap Come your on. hands. On, the man. enemy don't want you to open your mouth. Come on. Jonah being the That's prophet, it. being the preacher at that moment to go and deliver the message that God had given them. And some people are getting mad at the preacher. Oh, Jesus. Jesus. Go ahead, true. Oh, yeah. That's the word. They get mad at the preacher because the preacher tells them what the words say. But you don't have a right. You don't have a right. Come on. 
Come on. You gotta take that up with God. If you hold on to that very thing, that very thing will bring you down. Yes, sir. They sitting in there waiting. Sitting and waiting. They have took a seat in their heart. That I'm waiting to hear something. I'm waiting to hear something about their marriage. I'm waiting to hear something about their children. I'm waiting to hear something about their downfall. I'm waiting to hear something. But you have asked God to forgive you. Oh, come on now. That's it. We're praying wrong. Praying wrong. Because we asking God to do this for me. God forgive me. And but we have not forgave who? Them. Oh yes. Word. We have not forgave who we supposed to. We have not given that thing up. We have not given that anger off, that unforgiveness. But we study going before God. God, do this. God, this. And you wonder why some things held up. It's held up because you have took a seat and you're waiting. And it's resting there in your heart. The unforgiveness. Look, this is not coincidence. No, it's not. This is the word of God that yes, is facts, oh, yes, and yes, we're yes. right here. Oh, yes. We are right here in the word of God, and Amen. about to finish show up. Amen. You cannot Amen. make Amen. this up. Amen. You cannot Amen. make it up. Amen. You can't even copy this no. the way that God is bringing oh, forth yes. this word, because God wants us to truly be delivered. Oh, yes. God wants us to get rid of unforgiveness out of our heart. Amen. He wants us not to walk in anger. Yes. That's the reason why you got people that church, how mean they are and their attitudes and how they looked at me. You know why? They got some issues going on in their heart that they have not dealt with. But you cannot look at the church as that because that's not the church. If we gonna truly be the church, the called out ones, then we gonna have to get our hearts right. He on the inside looking 
in the city. Why God haven't destroyed Nineveh yet? When he told me to go and preach. See, the preacher going to always be tested. Are you going to go and deliver what I tell you to do and say the way that I tell you to say it? Are you going to go and love or are you going to go and hate? You know Jonah was mad going through Nineveh. Yet 40 days and Nineveh shall be overthrown. Yet 40 days and Nineveh shall be overthrown. Yet 40 days.
forget about that. Oh, yes, oh, no. No. We, we, we forget. We forget about that. We forget that God was the one that covered us and he was the one that protected us. I told you we didn't create nothing. No, no one. It said the Lord God prepared a plant and made it come up over Jonah that it might be shame for his head to deliver him from his misery. See God, he will step in the very you, you was hurt, you was torn out, and you was trying to get back to that place in God, and God saw your misery, and God came in and covered you, and God brought you out of that situation, but you forgot that fast, because what you were carrying, you didn't want to forgive them, uh, you were still holding it, but God showed you mercy, so that you may show mercy, he said the merciful shall obtain Oh, yeah, yeah, you forget about those times when you're going through. You forget about how God covered you, how God protected you, how God healed your body. But now you want to see them sick. Now you want to see them destroyed. Now you want to see them in prison. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. But you forget about them. Yeah, I know, I know, I know, I know we forget very quickly. Jonah, look, when God covered him, when God bring you out of something, and God do that for you, you know it was God. Look, Jonah was very grateful for the plan. He was very grateful for the plan. Look, the plant that he didn't see, mm -hmm. the plant that he didn't create, mm -hmm. but he was very grateful because it did something for him. Oh, oh, yeah. Come on, that's powerful. Come on. When it ain't doing nothing for you. You don't want to see something yeah, going right. good for somebody else. Right. Oh, because it ain't better for you. Whoever digs a pit will fall into it, and he who rolls a stone will have it roll back on him. Yeah, yeah, some people try to dig a pit for other people. They want them to fall in the pit just because of what happened to them. I told y'all a lot of people haven't got over what happened to them as children, what happened to them as they start growing up. They, they haven't got past that. They still carry unforgiveness. The little girl in them haven't been delivered. The little boy in them haven't been delivered. Because I'm holding animosity. I'm holding anger. And it's stopping me from getting to the place where I need to get involved. But when you realize that I didn't create nothing, nor no one, I get you not done. For what God come on, come on. had created for him <laughs> in his time of misery, right? Oh, yeah. God arranged this. Yeah. God created this. He set this right there for Jonah. Mm -hmm. yeah. And God have covered us and, and arranged things for us right. to cover and protect us and be merciful unto us. Oh, yes. But we don't want to be merciful yeah. to nobody else. Oh, my God. But as the morning done, uh -huh. the next day, look, 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 God created a worm, mm -hmm. and it so damaged the plant uh -huh. that it withered. Wait a minute. Mm -hmm. God created the plant uh -huh. to be shaved. He was trying to show Jonah something. Mm -hmm. And sometimes we don't know why stuff coming back to back here, yeah. and why this happening, and why that's happening. God trying to show you something. Uh -huh. God bless you right here. God give you favor, uh -huh. but then God will pull back, uh, yeah. and then this will end up going on, or this be pulled back. God trying to show you what's in you, right? Yeah. Come on, man. and let you know you didn't create nothing. You don't have the right to stay there. Yeah. That place. Yeah. Come on, first lady, first. He created the plant to cover him, and then he turned around and created the worm. Yeah. 
<laughs> to eat the plant. Eat it up. The okay. very plant that he created. He created, he created this. Yes. yes. And Jonah seen this. <laughs> he said the next day God prepared a worm. <laughs> and it so damaged the plant that it withered. The, now the plant, what was covering me, <laughs> what God had given me shade of, <laughs> is now gone. <laughs> Ooh, my God. It's now gone. It's withered away. And it happened when the sun arose that God prepared a venomous east wind and the sun beat on Jonah's head so that he grew faint. Then he wished death for himself and said, it is better for me to die than to live. Wait a minute, Jonah. Not the prophet, not the man of God. You got that much wickedness in your heart. That much in your heart. Now you mad that the, what was covering me is gone. And a lot of times people get outside of God and the very things that's in their heart now they want to blame God. Now they'll rather die or they'll rather be back out in the world. It was better for me to be back out in the world. At least I did. I can do this. I can do that. And I don't have to worry about all of this. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what? The devil ain't going to make you worry about all of that. Because he won't Oh, 
some harsh words coming from the prophet. Where you let pride get in the way. I'd rather die with it before I tell them I'm sorry. I'd rather take it to my grave to help them. I heard people say it, but not realizing what they're saying. The stubbornness will stop them from getting their hearts right and it'll make them hit hell and not go to heaven. Come on now, first letter. Oh, I know we don't want to hear it. Oh, that's the word. But when you really want to be delivered, to, and I don't want to be delivered for real, I don't want to stay delivered for real. I don't need no Kool-Aid with lots of sugar. Oh, yeah, yeah, but I need God to come straight forward. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I need God to correct me where I'm wrong. To show me, God. Show me so that I can get it right. Yes, Hallelujah. You want to say I'm I got the right to be angry right. even to them. Now you don't. Right. You got people that, that, that they don't speak to family uh -huh. because they got so much anger and so much right. unforgiveness. Mm -hmm. I hate I was even born in oh, this family. I, 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 I hate them. I hate who I'm some kin to. Mm -hmm. What type of stuff is that in God created? Them and created you and created the family that you was born into. What give you the right? I'm telling you. Yes, you are. Some people, yeah. some people, they, they, they you yeah. know what? Yeah. They truly need to go get therapy. Yeah. It ain't nothing wrong with you going to get therapy. Yeah. It, it, it's nothing yeah. wrong yeah. with you going to get therapy. Hey, some people need it. You need to get a Christian therapy. Yeah. And you need to go and sit down on that couch. Yeah. If you can't get that, you don't understand what's going on. And you said it going to, no, you need to go see somebody. See somebody. Because if, if you come into the house of God and that thing is not, not moving either, you're not being receptive and receiving that thing and grabbing hold to that word and taking that word to change your heart. And you started holding on to some things and you thinking, well, stuff ain't going, I don't know what it is. I don't know what, no, no, it might be what's in your heart. And you might need to go to the third that is an issue underneath that you're not willing to let come yeah, yeah, yeah. come up. You, you, you don't want it to be purged out right uh -huh, now. Uh -huh. You want to keep carrying it because it's your pillow. And it, it feels good to you when you carry it and you put it on other people and you laying this on other people and you start saying this ain't right and this going wrong and that, going, that might be a pillow for you. But then you don't know what you're doing to the other people. Right. You don't want that. But the Lord said you have had pity on the plant oh for which you have not labored nor made it grow, mm -hmm. which came up in the night and perished in the night. God said you have had pity. You, 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 you wanted to have compassion mm. on this plant. Mm. Oh, yeah, yeah. You wanted to spare the plant. Mm. You know, you have some people, they don't rather have compassion on the animal uh -huh. than the person. Oh, oh my God. Oh, yeah, yeah. They'll show more compassion uh -huh. towards the animal oh, than towards people. Right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Why did Jonah show more pity towards the plant? Mm. He didn't create it. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Why are you so mad if you didn't have to labor for this? Uh -huh. You didn't have to go out there and plant this. You didn't have to do none of that. Why are you so angry? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. He said, which came up in the night and perished at night. God was trying to show him what was in him. And he said, and should I not pity Nineveh, that great city, and which are more than 120,000 persons who, get, who cannot discern between their right hand and their left hand? And he said, and much livestock. So you rather have pity on this one plant. And you got 120,000 people here in Nineveh. Oh, yeah, yeah. Plus their livestock. You would rather to have pity on a plant than on all these people, than on their souls. You're not concerned about their souls. We got to get to a point. I told you, you didn't make that come into existence. God be it. You did not on that God did you did not make it God did oh my God 